Oh, boy, that was the height of my ambition at that time. I'll tell you what, I remember the sermon that I preached. Uh, he called me to come and do a revival for him, and that meant I had to preach starting on that Sunday night at his uh, broadcast and then preach Monday all the way through Friday. And uh, one of the sermons that I preached at that time, which was my what I call my stick, was called Hell's Train. <laughs> And so uh, I preached the sermon, and he was telling another preacher on the phone about how well I had preached it, and that was the greatest compliment to hear him tell somebody else how well I had preached. And he talked about the showmanship, he said, that I had, because in that day, in the era of the 70s, 60s, that kind of time, uh, showmanship. Nobody was as good of a showman in the pulpit as Reverend Franklin was. He, he, he knew how to dress, number one. All of his suits were tailored. He brought to the pulpit tailored suit with coat, vest, pants, and a tailored top coat to match the, the, the suit that he was wearing, which was made out of the same material. And then when he preached, he had the showmanship. He knew how to take a microphone and turn a microphone around and pull it to him and make it come back, kind of like the rock and roll singers of that day would do. So it was the, the research that he had put into a message, which meant that he had a great message. It was certainly the gift that he articulated in terms of hooping and being able to make that close uh, jail with whatever it was that he was preaching about, plus the showmanship that he had when he preached. It was one thing to hear Reverend Franklin preach. It was a totally different world to see Reverend Franklin preach. Whatever your mental attitude is, has a lot to do with what you're gonna be and how successful you are in your efforts. Now, in other words, if you you are a grasshopper. That's exactly what you are. If you think you are too weak, you are too weak. If you anticipate failure, believe me, you're going to fail. We'll be blown. Yes, it will. One day, the cloud will be lifted. 